you know, I am actually very uh, tempted to quote uh, the guru himself, Mr. Warren Buffett. Uh, he says that an entry level people look for three things intellect, energy, and integrity. And he says, if you can't get integrity, don't bother with the first two. This whole domain of character ethic in today's world of number driven, metrics driven, mad rat race, here is, is, is one of the most respected leaders in the world uh, on a sustainable basis saying, look at intellect, energy and integrity. Uh, and therefore, what kind of character you bring to the table? So, so, so few things for instance, firstly, are you really meritocratic, which means your technical quotient, you know your onions. People know that you know your stuff inside out. No substitute for good old fashioned competence, number one. Number two, organizational agility. It's no good being a highly intellectual guy sitting in an armchair. When you walk into an organization, your, your on the go capacity, on the go is the word, on the go. Unfortunately, today's pace doesn't give you the luxury of time to think back. So are you the swift on the go guy who can quickly smell the change, uh, quickly adapt to the situation and get very pragmatic and practical to deliver results. So I think that's very, very important. Because a lot of business school candidates come out saying, I'm technically good, so you know, I'm God's gift to mankind. But organization realities are far, far away from um, just the bookish knowledge. Third thing, you're not working alone in any case, unless you're on one-off individual contributor. Even there, you need to interact. So this huge capacity to, to work with others. And when I say that, what I mean is not, not with somebody who you like. You're thrown in a project sometimes with a person who does not like you, you don't like. Can you sync the differences, have an absolutely professional approach and attitude, and really get on to stitching a beautiful team together and delivering? And no question about compliance, ethics, then these are like givens. But if I were to make a differentiator today, uh, when I see a candidate, when I interview, do I see that spark in the person that he's really up and about? Do I see that energy? Do I see that passion? Passion is number one. And passion has to be manifest through systemic applications and behavioral manifestations. So the passion and the third thing, the whole framework of governance, ethics, compliance framework because uh, that's core today and that that's why it links back to integrity and the whole domain of character ethic so to me the students need to quickly adapt to the realities become very result oriented I think it's very important to be result oriented outcome based otherwise you keep doing a lot of your theoretical stuff uh, and it's a lot of activity uh, no results